Obtain the mesh file and also the full training movie by purchasing this product. Heating, ventilation and air conditioning or HVAC is a set of process used to control the temperature, humidity and the ambient air quality of an environment. The present study examines the performance of fan drive and airflow inside an office for HVAC operation including a computer and four lamps. The computer is made of plastic and is considered as a heat source while each lamp material is glass and a heat source is equal to 2500 watts per cubic meter on the upper part of two walls of the office we installed two fans to transfer airflow into the office we also assumed that the doors and windows of the office have convection heat transfer by ambient air the problem goal is to investigate the effect of blown airflow on the components and people in the office also we simulate the influence of airflow on the heat sources applied in the model The present three-dimensional model was designed by Design Modeler Software. The geometry consists of a cubic space called the Office for HVAC Operation, which consists of several components including human, lamp, computer, desk, and so on. Also, an unstructured mesh was performed using ANSYS meshing software, and meshing has been done more accurately for the internal components of the office. from the mesh display section we can display every boundaries and surfaces including inlets outlets walls and so on there are two heaters in the computational domain that both of them are heat sources with a specified heat source magnitude the room domain is filled with the air this is a polynomial equation for defining the pressure jump of the fan Every wall that is in connection with both inner and outer fluid should be a coupled wall in thermal condition. The computer has a constant temperature equal to 310 degrees of Kelvin and is made from plastic as we mentioned before. And finally, the window has convection thermal condition. The heat transfer coefficient is 25. That is more than the heat transfer coefficient with the door. And also the free stream temperature is 10 degree of Celsius again. And the window thickness that is made from glass is equal to 2 cm. A standard initialization method has been used for this CFT simulation and also the initial value for the temperature is equal to 10 degrees of Celsius. The density contour. Also by following this way we can obtain the volume average temperature of the room after the simulation. Here is a summary of the steps to define and solve the problem as a review. Obtain the mesh file and also the full training movie by purchasing this product. To benefit from master CFD services including simulation, consultation and training, contact our experts via info at signmastercfd.com.